I have some questions. Tell me why the whole internet is obsessed with this movie. I don't understand. I have heard on multiple occasions that this is apparently the greatest sequel ever made. That is like a consensus on the internet. I saw the first Shrek movie. I loved it, but I don't think I've seen this one. So let's watch the greatest sequel ever made and let's watch Shrek 2. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here and welcome if you're new. Today, we are diving on into a movie that I have seen all over the internet in the past, I don't know, five years or so. I feel like it's really blown up online and is being lauded as the greatest sequel ever made. I'm a little confused. I don't think I've seen this movie, quite frankly. I really don't know. I'm pretty sure. I'm like, 90% sure that I haven't seen it. I know that I've seen the original Shrek. I very much loved that movie as a kid. Many amazing quotes in that movie, like in the morning, I'm making waffles. And you know, the whole Duloc play song, I loved that song as a kid growing up. Not the gumdrop buttons, like all the amazing quotes. I loved that movie. It was so good. And I feel like I didn't see the sequel and I feel like that wasn't a big deal at the time to not see the sequel. And then years later, I grow up and everyone's talking about this movie being incredible. And I feel like I missed something. Like, I feel like I missed the boat on something. And now I wanna know, I wanna know why this movie is so good. So yeah, we haven't watched Shrek here on my channel, but that's because I've seen it. I've seen it a lot. Um, especially a lot in my youth. It's definitely been a while since I've watched it, but I remember what happens in it. I remember the plot and all the fun little lines and stuff. And I just kind of want to watch this one because it's talked about so much on YouTube. Again, like I said, I'm pretty sure I haven't seen it. There's like a small 10% chance that I'll watch this and all of a sudden it'll come rushing back to me, but I'm, I'm, I'm like 99% sure that I haven't watched it. And with all that being said, I'm just really excited to hop on into this one because I have to know why everyone loves it. I just have to know. <laughs> but real quick, before we do that, I just wanna do the quote of the day. Okay, so here is your like button quote of the day. Leave the like button, take the cannoli. If you know where that's from, smash the like button. Anyway, without any further ado, I think it's finally time to watch this movie. So if y'all are ready, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into Shrek 2. It was he who would chance the perilous journey through- It's weird, cause we, yeah, isn't, you're too late. You're too late, bro. She's already, is he gonna get there late or something? For he was the bravest and most. Is he wearing a hairnet so his hair doesn't get, oh my God. In all the land. He's narrating his own life journey as it's happening. Would break the dreaded curse. Well, She's gone, dude. There's no way she's here. Shrek already got her, right? Pull back the gossamer curtains to find her. <gasps> <laughs> Where is she? She's on her honeymoon. Her honeymoon! With who? Yeah, you're late, bro. Aww. Accidentally in love. Ah! Oh my God, they have a gingerbread house. Ah! Aww. Aww. Oh. It's so mean, just leave him alone. Oh, oh, they're so happy. <laughs> oh, got a donkey here. Donkey! <laughs> donkey? Shrek! Fiona! Oh. Give us a hug, Shrek, you oh. old love machine. I love him, I love Donkey. How about a side of sugar for the Steve? Donkey. <laughs> Shouldn't you be getting home to Dragon? Dragon? Yeah, that. I don't know. She's been all moody and stuff lately. Did they date at the end of the movie? Is that what happened? Oh, I can't remember that part. Fiona and I are married now. We need a little time, you know, to be together. Yeah. Oh, 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 no. I will always be here to make sure nobody bothers you. Donkey. Yes, oh. Ruby. You're bothering Ruby, me. Ruby, yes, Ruby. Oh, oh, Donkey. Oh, oh. I feel bad for Donkey, but like, yeah, you can't. Donkey. He's still there! 
Why did he come back in? Hey, but what do you want me to tell these other guys? Oh no. Is it the other prince is here? No f***ing way. <laughs> Enough, Reggie. Oh, Reggie! You are hereby summoned to the kingdom of far, far away for a royal ball in celebration of your marriage. Love, the king and queen of far... This king and queen have no clue. Away, mom and dad. Oh, it's mom and dad! Holy Don't you think they might be a bit... Shocked. They have no idea. They have no idea that she's stuck in ogre form now. But they're my parents, Shrek. They love me. No, they don't. They sent you away to a castle, honey. I don't think they're great parents. Well, if you want to be a part of this family, yes. And who says I want to be part of this family? Uh, you married her, boy! Well, there's some fine print for you. <gasps> they're already fighting. Oh my god. The honeymoon is over. We are not going, and that's final. You don't have- yeah. Ha 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 ha. Come on, Shrek, we don't want to hit traffic. That's hilarious. Yeah, you have no say, bro. <laughs> oh my God, it's Hollywood. It's Hollywood. The bond trees. Versace. Star maps, tours. Oh my God, I'm dying. I am dying. Wow, her parents are king and queen of like this big ass fancy town. That's crazy. I hope they're cool, but I don't think they're going to be cool about the fact that they look like ogres. I imagine it's not going to be like how Fiona hopes it is, and I'm sad. Is he releasing doves? Oh no. Why don't you guys go ahead? I'll park the car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wasn't she supposed to kiss Prince Charming and break the spell? Wow, there's gonna be like a parallel to them being like racist man they're, i bet they're gonna be like you could just kiss a different prince charming you can marry someone who who we like well um it's easy to see where fiona gets her good looks from <laughs> <gasps> <gasps> with a little killer bird right over him jesus that's funny oh dude stop he's scowling at him it's so crazy he helped rescue me from the dragon. Yep, that's me, the noble steed. The noble steed? Hey, waiter, how about a bowl for the steed? <laughs> that is assuming you don't eat your own gown. Dad. Oh, no, we usually prefer the ones who've been locked away in a tower. Oh. You wouldn't understand. You're not her father. <sighs> oh, my God. It's so nice to have the family together for dinner. Oh, poor, poor mom. <laughs> Fiona. Fiona. Mom. Harold. Donkey. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I feel so bad for her. What's going on with the tears and the bubbles? What's going on? What? Is it Galinda? Oh, it's her little fairy godmother, isn't it? Who are you? Oh, this is Sweet Pea. I'm your fairy godmother. Yeah, well, she hasn't seen you in years. A wave of my magic wand. Your troubles will soon be gone. Yeah, but her issues are the one thing she needs help with is her family drama, and you can't fix that with magic, ma'am. I really don't need all this. <laughs> oh. I didn't like you anyway. <laughs> Fiona. Where's the dog? <laughs> oh, the poor dog. The dog is cute, though. But remember, dear, if you should ever need me. Happiness was just a teardrop away. Oh, a teardrop away. Uh-oh. It's going to be a movie filled with lots of tension in the marriage. And they just got married. I don't think I was going to get daddy's blessing, even if I did want it. Well, do you think it might be nice if somebody asked me what I wanted? Yeah, maybe you make it about her, since it's her family. I've made changes for you, Shrek. Think about that. Yeah, it's not all about you, dude. Stretch it out here for a while. You better get in. We need to talk. Oh no. She's an evil fairy godmother, huh? Oh, why is she mad? What's new? You remember my son, Prince Charming. Oh, this was the man Fiona was supposed to marry. It was an arranged marriage. Well, what am I supposed to do about it? Use your imagination. Oh my god. 
I wonder if we're going to see Fiona go back to her human form at all in this. I wonder if like she falls out of love with Shrek, if that's possible. But I don't think that I know they'll end up together in the end. I'm just kind of curious how this is going to go. I like that they're having like marital problems because of like family tension. I think that makes sense. Oh, is he going to hire like an assassin or something? Like my town. Hook! Wow. Real risky of you to come here, King. There's only one fella can handle a job like that. And frankly, he don't like to be disturbed. Mm, where could I find him? Who is it? Who is it? Wait, what if it... Is it... Is it going to be Puss in Boots? It's going to be Puss in Boots! Because I know Antonio Banderas is Puss in Boots. But for these, I charge a great deal of money. Ah! It's total... It's Puss in Boots. Oh my God. Just tell me... Where I can find this ogre. Oh my God, this is so funny that they didn't reveal him there. I mean, I've seen photos of Puss in Boots and I know it's Antonio Banderas, so I know that, but that's so funny that they didn't reveal him there. Cause he's so cute. Mom says that when I'm old enough, my handsome Prince Charming will rescue me from my tower and bring me back to my family. Her handwriting as a child looks a lot like mine. Like a lot like mine. Mrs. Fiona Charming. I wrote the exact same way. Oh, yeah. Listen, don't don't freak out about that. We all do that. I would I did that as a kid, and I'm not married to the boys I wrote in my notebook. All girls do that. I was hoping you'd let me apologize for my despicable behavior earlier. He's gonna apologize, but yet he just hired an assassin. I was actually hoping you might join me for a morning hunt, a little father son time. I know it would mean the world to Fiona. Oh, it would, and yet he's gonna send an assassin. Oh my God, he's gonna do it. Face it, donkey, we're lost. We can't be lost. We follow the king's instructions exactly. Don't feel bad, bro. It's not your fault. Puss in boots. He's purring. He's purring. Shrek, donkeys don't purr. Yeah. Kind of <laughs> <laughs> Fear me if you dare. Hey, look, a little cat. Hey, look, a little cat. Come here, oh, come here little kitty. Ah! Ah! You're so little. Get out. Hold still. Drag. Hold still. Ooh. Ooh. Did I miss? Uh huh. You got them. Pray for mercy from. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Got a hairball, huh? <laughs> oh god! <laughs> hairball. It's so nasty. I was doing it only for my family. My mother, she's sick, and my father leaves all the garbage. The king offered me magic gold, and I have a litter of brothers. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> He's so cute. He already spilled the tea. Fiona's father paid you to do this? The rich king? See. Si. I know, it's pretty sad. Maybe Fiona would have been better off if I were some sort of prince charming. See, si. that's what the king said. You're not a... Oh, uh, oh. I thought that question was that. <laughs> Not helping, buddy. Oh my god, I love how quickly Puss in Boots is just like not trying to kill him anymore. Happiness. A teardrop away. Donkey, think of the saddest thing that's ever happened to you. Oh, the cat's gonna make him cry. <laughs> you little hairy little licking sucker. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> the cat's just part of the team now. This is so awesome. Stop, Ogger! I have misjudged you. Join the club, we've got jackets. <laughs> I am obliged to accompany you until you have saved your life, as you have spared me mine. I'm sorry, the position of annoying talking animal has already been taken. Let's go, Shrek! Oh, he's gonna bring, he's, oh, he's gonna bring him. <laughs> I've seen this image before. <laughs> ah, it's working on him! He's so cute! Look at him! He's a ah! Ah, doggy's jealous. Oh. Her house is like attached to a factory. No way. Ah, bro. T G I F. Oh. 
Wouldn't it made more sense to put Puss in Boots in the costume? Well, I guess you couldn't have snuck Shrek in there. We're gonna steal some potions, yes. He's such a good little burglar, look at him. Oh no, you're gonna break it. Oh, or not. Donkey. Oh, finally, I'm going to use for your mouth. Uh oh. Go! Ah, more good music. Oh, the head! Yes! <laughs> so cute! Oh my god, they are escalating very quick. What kind of potion is that? Oh! Oh, all right, good. If one of you drinks this, you both will be fine. Happiness, comfort, and beauty divine. I guess it means it'll affect Fiona too. Don't just drink it yet. Well. Oh my God. Here's to us, Fiona. Why? Just wait. You love being a I woman. know. Shouldn't you do it in front of Fiona? God, you guys are being stupid. But I love Fiona more. That's very sweet, but you should tell her what you're doing. What if it changes the way you look and she doesn't believe that it's you? Oh my god, the zoom. <laughs> oh my god. Maybe it's a dud. Oh. Or maybe Fiona and I were never meant to be. Oh no, the storm clouds rolling. Oh. Oh. The mushroom chain. Oh boy. Oh my God. So are they gonna wake up and look totally different? Like he's gonna be like a man and Donkey's gonna be like a horse? <laughs> what do they look like? Oh my God. Donkey's gonna be a totally beautiful horse, isn't he? I'm so excited. But there's no way that the movie will, like they're gonna stay like that. They're gonna have to go back to their normal selves. Cause it, these stories are always, I feel like the first Shrek was like about loving and accepting yourself. And I feel like this one is like that too. Good morning, sleepyhead. Ah, ah. Good morning. Hi. The kitty! Ah! Ah! Kitty! Ah! Ah! Oh. oh my god. Uh, have you ladies seen my donkey? Who are you calling donkey? Ah! Yeah! Dying, baby! I can win it! <laughs> I can count! I'm trotting. Oh my god. To make the effect of this potion permanent. Oh, it's not permanent right now. Drinker must obtain his true love's keys by midnight. Yeah, you should have waited. Look out, princess. Here comes the new me. Oh. Uh, first things first. We need to get you out of those clothes. No, she's not going to recognize you. You got to wear. Oh god, this is going to be a problem. Oh, all the people with pitchforks that normally would be looking at him. Changes. Don't wanna be I, I can't get over Puss in Boots just always like so confident and cute. I love him. Seeing the taste was not so sweet. Just, just, just. Well, <laughs> the ritual, time may change me. Of course. But I can't change time. Fiona. Oh no. It's her. Hello, handsome. Uh-oh. Fiona. Oh no. No no no, that's not him. I, Fiona, it is me. No! Uh, well, you were gonna pretend like you're Shrek? That's to, to marry her? Fiona! Fiona! Oh no! No! Don't you think you've already messed her life up enough? The audacity. And now she can be. But no, that's, that's not true. She'll just go back into ogre form if they don't kiss. She's not gonna be in love with your son, man. She's a princess. And you're an ogre. Oh my god. That's something no amount of potion is ever going to change. Wow. And it doesn't need to. You're fine as an ogre. I love her. Oh. If you really love her, you'll let her go. Someone really got to tell Shrek that the fairy godmother is the mother of Charming. He's got no idea he's being manipulated. Everybody wins. Except for you. Harold's here. Harold! Is Harold, has he come to his senses? She's uh, in the back. What? Maybe not. Oh, the fairy god. 
Oh, no, he hasn't come to his senses. Okay. Perhaps it's best if we just call the whole thing off, okay? What? what? I mean, you can't force someone to fall in love. <laughs> no, you can't. Oh, uh, with a potion? Have Fiona drink this and she- That's f***ed up. The first man she kisses, which will be charming. No f***ing way. You can't do that to your daughter. If you remember, I helped you with your happily ever after. <gasps> what? Really? Oh, this is how she gets people. This is how she blackmails people. So is his love not really real with his wife? Thank you, mother. Mother! Doggy! Bandits! Stop them! Oh boy. The abs are fab and it's glutious to the max. The abs are fab! It's a red carpet! Oh my God. Tonight on night. Ah, now here's a good show. We got a white Bronco heading east into the forest. A white Bronco! Oh, they're gonna get involved, aren't they? They gotta help them. Catnip, that's uh, no mind. Ah, uh, Catnip! <laughs> Rewind it! Shrek, I'm her husband. Shrek, ow, ow! Pinocchio just turns fully around with his head. I can't believe, I can't believe he would do this. This is so messed up. I can't believe you would do this to your daughter. You're awful. I mean, you might find you like this new Shrek. But it's the old one I fell in love with, Dad. Yeah, Dad. I'd give anything to have him back. Oh. Ah, uh, darling, that's mine. <gasps> He's gonna drink it? He, he gave her the right one, didn't he? The one without the potion. He changed it, didn't he, I think. I think, or maybe he didn't. I feel like he switched it because he felt bad. Mission, mission impossible. Oh, quick, tell a lie. Say something crazy like I'm wearing ladies underwear. I'm, I, uh, I'm wearing ladies underwear. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. The mouse just fumbling around on the floor trying to figure out where he is. Well, folks, it looks like we're up Chocolate Creek without a popsicle stick. <laughs> what? What idea are you having? Do you still know the Muffin Man? Well, sure, he's down on Drury Lane. Is a Drury Lane near the castle? Because aren't we far, far away? Oh, my God. Yeah, I guess he lives in far, far away. Fire up the ovens, Muffin Man. We've got a big order to fill. Oh, my God. We're going to bake a cookie. It's a giant gingerbread man! That's awesome! Ah! Ladies and gentlemen, presenting Princess Fiona. Oh my god, I wonder if she did take the potion. I don't know. Did 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 dad give it to her or not? I don't think he did. Where have all the good men gone? And where are all the gods? <laughs> I do love this song. Oh, I feel so bad for her. She like knows something's up, but she's being forced into this. This is so messed up. I toss and I turn and I dream of what I need. Hit it. <laughs> Q Shrek riding in on a gingerbread cookie. Yeah! I need a hero. Uh-oh, Mongo. Come on, Mongo. Yep. Oh, he's angry now. He's screeching! <laughs> All right. Get in there! Quick! No! Get in there! Oh no, Gigi! <laughs> oh, poor Gigi. <laughs> Oh my God, this is amazing. Puss. Go, keep going. Go, go, your lady needs you, go. Ah! Oh, I love it. <gasps> is he doing the, is he doing the, <laughs> I'm gone. Yes, F yes. Yes, yes. Get the wand! I see London! I see France! I'm a real boy! <laughs> Blowing her away! That's amazing! 
Oh no, they couldn't catch it. Ah! Oh! Sorry, Pinocchio. It was fun while it lasted. Pray for mercy from Puss and Donkey. Kiss her now. Oh no, that's awful. Oh no, that's horrible. Oh wait, no, she didn't take it, did she? There's no way. Did Harold take it? I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Yeah! Oh, yay! Oh! I told you ogres don't live happily ever after! Yes, they do. Just because they don't look the way you want them to. Oh, it reflected back at her. Ha! Oh, she gone now. Bye-bye. That's hysterical. Bye-bye. <gasps> Dad, Dad's gone too. Oh, you know, that's, aw. That's really sweet. Yep. He's a frog. <laughs> no way. He's a frog. <laughs> Is that why Fiona was an ogre? And he gave you a hard time. Donkey. No, no, he's right. I'm sorry. <laughs> To both of you. Ah! This is why she had fro ogre tendencies. No one told her. He was a frog. Oh my god. I just wish I could be the man you deserve. Oh. Oh. You're more that man today than you ever were. Warts and all. Oh. Midnight. Fiona, is this what you want? Oh yeah, ask her that. That's important. Because if you kiss me now, we can stay like this. Donkey really wants it. Donkey's like, can you please just kiss for me? <laughs> I don't think she wants that, though. I want what any princess wants. To live happily ever after. With the ogre I married. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. Oh, I'm crying. You cannot make me cry. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, poor donkey though. He'd love to be a horse, I bet. Oh, yep, there he goes. <laughs> this is such a thruple, man. They're so funny. I know, donkey. I know, I know, I know. Maybe donkey would have changed back anyway, though, because he didn't have a true love. Maybe if he'd kissed his true love, it would have. he would have stayed a horse, but. <sighs> <laughs> you still look like a noble steed to me. Oh. Oh, that's so cute. I'm crying. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah! Give them the appreciation they deserve, damn it. Hey, isn't we supposed to be having a fiesta? Uno, <gasps> dos, cuatro, hit it! Ah! 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 <laughs> Dancing in the rain. Push and pull you down. Aww. Aww. Oh, that was Julie Andrews. Oh my God. I don't even. That shot, though. Oh my God. You know, I think because I was born in 93, like, I, I just feel like every song in this movie was so nostalgic for me. <laughs> like, I've definitely heard that Live in the Vida, blah, blah. I've definitely heard that Live in the Vida Loca song on the radio. Like, the version with Antonio Banderas and I, I think Eddie Murphy. And there were so many, like, 2000s bops in this movie. Like, it just was so nostalgic with the music. Oh my God, this was so cute. Like... Oh, this is so sweet. I do remember like seeing clips of Puss in Boots on the internet. So that wasn't really a surprise to me. I knew Antonio Banderas was in this movie as Puss in Boots. I've seen photos of Puss in Boots, especially like that photo where he looks all cute with the big eyes. I've seen that a lot. So that didn't surprise me at all. But the whole plot, like the whole premise was so sweet because I feel like the first movie has a lot to deal with like emotional growth and um, learning to accept love from another person and willingness to be comfortable in your own skin. But there was even more of that in this movie. And it was just so sweet. Like they had the option to change who they were and she didn't want that. And it was just so, so sweet. I really liked this. This is fun, man. There were so many fun little jokes too. Like I love the whole idea that Far, Far Away is basically Hollywood. <laughs> 
<laughs> there are all these like references to other fairy tale stories or even horror stories or other movies, you know, like the Frankenstein reference. There were just so many great reversals comedy wise too. Like you think it's going one way, but in reality, it's like, <laughs> it's a completely different direction. Like even something as simple as when they were in the chariot flying around and they stopped abruptly and the fairy godmother was like threatening Harold and you thought they were going to throw him out of the car and in reality they're just at a fast food restaurant like little things like that were just so funny i definitely understand why people love this it's it's adorable it's got such a sweet heartfelt message and the father really like redeems himself in the perfect way in the end and then it makes total sense why he's acting the way that he's acting because he doesn't want his daughter to go through what he went through and felt was wrong about himself. It's just, it's like so perfect. And the addition of like new characters like Puss in Boots too are just, he's amazing. He's so cute. <laughs> he's so cute. Ah! And I loved the whole like heroic sequence at the end. Holding Out for a Hero is just like an amazing song. It's truly one of like the best songs I feel like. It's so, it's so awesome. I love it. It works in so many different stories and movies. And I feel like with this little sequence that they had at the end of the movie here. It was absolutely perfect. This was so much fun. I really enjoyed watching this. I would totally watch it again, like in a year or two. I think it's adorable. I think the message is really, really sweet. And it was just a nice lighthearted break during a week when I'm watching a lot of <laughs> darker, heavier stuff like The Last of Us. So uh, it was much needed. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this movie with me. If you did, please give it a thumbs up so that I know and I can watch more stuff like this in the future with y'all. Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below as well as any suggestions you might have next and subscribe if you want to. Till the next one, stay golden. Bye.